everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Yes, things look a little different today. I'm filming in a different orientation in my room. Y'all can let me know if you like this backdrop for filming better or not or what. There's a reason behind it. Um, so I got all set up to film today and discovered that the AC adapter cord for my Canon camera yeah couldn't plug in my canon camera and of course the battery pack to my canon camera is dead as a doornail because i always plug it in so not to delay my video i got out my trusty ring light and my iphone and that's what we're doing today so today i have a spring or spring to summer wardrobe refresh for you guys it's not really a haul from any store in particular it's kind of a mishmash of a bunch of different stuff i've got old navy i've got j crew factory i've got some things from democracy white house black market and i don't know target a little bit of everything so i've got a lot of looks to show you guys today so let's get into it and as always, you know that I will have everything linked down in the description box below. And I will copy those links to a comment and pin that comment to the top of the comment section so you can find it there if that's easier for you to do. And today, all the shoes that I'm wearing in the try-on are from Dream Pairs. I have worked with Dream Pairs before, so thank you to Dream Pairs for sponsoring today's video. This first look is an update to an outfit I showed you previously. These pants are the Linen Blend Wide Leg Pants from Old Navy. You guys love these. They have been a top seller on my channel all spring. I showed them in a previous video in an olive green color and I was wearing them in a size medium petite. But the more I looked at that footage, tried them on, I thought, you know, these are rather voluminous. Maybe I would do better with a small. And so I ordered, I returned the petite medium and I got these, which are a small regular. And I really like the way these fit much better. I don't have near as much extra fabric. And I actually like the length of the regulars uh, better than the petite. The petite were a hair too short, especially if I was going to wear any kind of heel. So here is a classic black outfit. Yes, you can wear black for spring and summer. I'm keeping it light with these linen blend pants and this scoop neck tank top. This is from Target. I have several of these tank tops in a variety of colors. Absolutely love them. And with this look, I'm wearing these sandals from Dream Pairs. They have just about a two inch heel and they are clear with silver studs. These are so comfortable and they're great when you need just a little bit of a heel, especially with a wide leg pant like this. I think they look great. They would equally look nice with a skirt or a dress. Here's a close up of that sandal that I was wearing with this outfit. You can see it just has it's about a two inch heel. It's a nice block heel, so easy to walk in. And the straps are just clear. They have these little silver studs. So just a very nice neutral sandal. It's got that ankle strap there that goes around your ankle. So they're nice and secure on your feet. And just a really easy shoe to wear with a variety of looks. And if you can see that, it also has the little stud detail little tiny studs going around the perimeter of the sandal. So just a really pretty sandal from Dream Pairs. Let's see what else I got. So if you follow me on Instagram, you will already recognize this skirt I'm wearing in this outfit. I've been on the hunt for a cargo skirt that didn't break the bank. I finally found one. This is from Democracy and I ordered it from the Democracy website and I got this one first and I liked it so much that I went back and ordered one in a green, which you'll see later. This skirt has that stretchy 
waistband that Democracy is known for, so it is super comfortable. The skirt itself has some spandex in it too, so it's gonna move with you when you sit and do whatever. It's so comfortable for this kind of skirt. And I wanna say this was like $62 or something like that, but if you sign up for their emails, they have like a 15% off your first purchase or something like that. And they're always having sales too. And with the skirt, I'm wearing just a basic V-neck tee from Old Navy. I was in need of some new t-shirts other than just solids. And so I picked this one up in the black and white stripe. I'm wearing this one in a medium and it's a nice relaxed fit. If you wanted it more fitted, you know, just get your normal size. But I went to a medium. I could have worn a small, but it would have been more snug. And the skirt is in a size six. Now with this outfit, I'm wearing some woven slide sandals from Dream Pairs. I chose black to kind of go with the black stripe in this shirt but any neutral would be fine, or even some sneakers. But these are really comfortable sandals. They are snug on your feet, but not too tight. They just feel very nice and secure when you're walking in them. Here's a close-up of that sandal. You see it's woven across here, and it's just a flat sandal, but this bottom is rubbery, and this is padded inside, so it's very comfortable. So these are just great slip-ons to wear with shorts, jeans, skirts, whatever. Really like these, and they do have kind of that squared off toe that's so popular right now. Let's see what's next. Well, like I said, that cargo skirt was so nice, I bought it twice. And here it is in a green color. You guys know I'm a sucker for green, so I had to go ahead and pick up this skirt in kind of this pale olive color. And now this little top, this is from Old Navy. I picked it up because I really like this squared off neckline. I like to open up my neck in the summertime. One, it helps keep me cool. And number two, it helps elongate me because I do have a very round face. I had someone on Instagram comment and tell me, um, they said, not trying to be rude, but that top looks too young for you. So number one, when somebody begins a statement with not trying to be rude, but just get prepared because they're about to be rude. And I'm curious as to what you guys think. Does this look too young? I'm wearing it in a medium. Yes, it's a fitted top, but I don't think it looks too young. What does that even mean? I mean, it's not a crop top. It's not a halter top. I don't, I don't know. It's a t-shirt with a scoop neck. I like the way it looks with a skirt because it's got the pink and the green floral in the tee, and that goes nicely with the green in the skirt. Now, I think it does make a really cute outfit if you add on a denim jacket. That just makes a real pull together, neat looking casual outfit out of this basic skirt and tee. And with this look, I'm wearing another pair of sandals from Dream Pairs. This is another slip on slide sandal with the woven top. It's very popular this year, all different kinds of woven sandals. These are super comfortable. The straps are very cushy, so they don't pinch or hurt your feet, even my problem feet. These are comfortable. And again, they've got the little stud detail around the border of the shoe, just adds a little extra touch. And these are comfortable as well. They are flat, but they've got a rubbery sole and the insole is padded. So another cute neutral shoe from Dream Pairs. So if you're following me on the LTK app or over on Instagram, well, first of all, thank you. But second of all, you may have already seen some of these items. And that's because I can put out a reel or an LTK post or an Instagram post or story a lot quicker than I can produce a whole YouTube video. And with popular things selling out quickly like they do, I encourage you to follow me on those platforms. That way you will get to see things first. And if there's something that you like, you can jump on it and get it before it sells out because they do sell out. And sadly, I've already been informed that this little blouse is sold out now. 
but they may restock it and check back because it may just be sold out in certain sizes. I'm wearing it in a size small. This is from J. Crew Factory. And I just love chambray and khaki together. It's a classic, but chambray goes great with everything. Today I'm showing it with these khaki shorts. These are from Banana Republic Factory. And I showed you guys these in an earlier video, but I love them so much. I bought them in four colors. I'm going to live in these shorts this summer. They fit so nicely. They're a nice weight. Uh, they are 98 or 99% cotton and the rest spandex. So you've got that stretch, but it's not so stretchy that it's not going to hold its shape. And I'm wearing the shorts in a size six. And I'm wearing the same dream pair of sandals as I did in the last look, just these neutral little slides. And I'm carrying my little toaster bag from Portland Leather Goods. I do partner with Portland Leather Goods. They aren't sponsoring this video, but I have a link for you guys that I will be sure to put down below. Use that link and you can go online. They're always having a sale. You can find crossbodies, tote bags, shoulder bags. They even have shoes and they're real leather. Quality bags and shoes at very reasonable prices. And they're based in Portland, Oregon. So check out Portland Leather Goods. And let's see what's next. So this next look is a little bit more of a mature look. And I say that because it reminds me of something my mother would have worn because she never met a white blouse that she didn't like. She probably had a hundred white blouses and I'm not joking because she had a uniform and it was a white blouse and either jeans or some other kind of pants. And that's what she wore every day, no matter what. So she had all kinds, fancy ones, plain ones, different fabrics. She loved a white blouse. Back to the outfit. This blouse is another great summertime fabric and it is cotton gauze. I love cotton gauze. It is right up there with linen as far as being breathable and cool for the summertime. I'm wearing this blouse in a size small regular and the pants i'm wearing are another pair of olive green pants my mother had a problem with white blouses apparently i have a problem with olive green pants but these are the preta petty pant from white house black market they come out with a version of these every single year i also have them in black and white they're a very lightweight cotton perfect for summer and they have that stretch making them oh so comfortable and these run on the short side because i'm wearing them in the re a regular size four and you see where they hit on me however you can let that hem out and undo the snap and it gives you a few more inches there and brings it down right around my ankle and with this outfit i am wearing yes a pair of ballet flats Ballet flats are back, if you didn't know, and these are from Dream Pairs, and these are in my true size, six and a half. I forgot to mention that. These shoes run very true to size. These are so comfortable. They don't dig in in the back like some of these ballet flats can, and they have a rounded toe and a little bow, so it's just the classic ballerina flat. The insides are very cushy, and then the bottoms are rubbery, so you're not going to slip or anything in these. And so since this outfit reminded me of my mother, I decided to wear the little ballet flats because she was a very classic shoe person too. And that rounds out this look. So in case you didn't know, eyelet is a big trend for 2023. And when I saw this cute eyelet top from J. Crew Factory, I had to get it. Comes in some different colors, but I love green, all shades of green. And so this just spoke to me. It's got the slight poofy gathers, not too crazy at the sleeves. And it's got the covered buttons all the way up the front. And it's just a cute little elevated kind of basic. And you can wear this with shorts, skirt, whatever. But I love the way the green looks with white denim. So that's what I went with for this outfit. And I think this would be a great outfit to throw on to go meet your friends for lunch or brunch. And I elevated it a little bit with 
the shoes. Yes, this is a heel. These are from Dream Pairs, and I love these shoes. I already featured these in a previous video I did. It's the one called um, Always Look Expensive. They go with everything. They're a great neutral, and they can really dress up a plain outfit like this. And I'm also carrying this little woven dumpling bag. I got this from Amazon, but it is a designer dupe for a much more expensive bag. But since it's something very trendy, I, you know, I'm not going to spend that kind of money. So I just got the Amazon version and it's very buttery soft and it's just so cute for a little clutch. These jeans are some that I have had for a few years now. And I don't think they're available anymore, but I will link some of my favorite white denim down below for you. J. Crew Factory has some great white denim that is not see-through. So I will be sure to link some options for you down below. And I'm wearing a size small in this blouse. Here's a close-up of the shoe, again with the squared off toe. And I love this crisscross kind of puffy design. And this is padded and that, that makes it really comfortable on your feet it doesn't squeeze or hurt or anything it's just like a nice soft cushy cloud <laughs> on your feet and they're very secure on your feet despite the heel and that's about a three inch heel which is that's about all i can manage these days so these are great for any kind of dress or to dress up a pants outfit they will go with everything I just noticed that you've been looking at my neighbor's ugly trash and recycling bins through <laughs> the window over here. They're not supposed to do that. Our covenants say you're supposed to keep those hidden. And I guess they are technically kind of hidden because they're around to the side of their house, but it's not a very nice view from in here. This next top is one from Old Navy. I've got the same white jeans on. This top though, it looks so much more expensive than it is. I was so shocked when I found this at Old Navy and saw how it fit because it is a really nice fit. The body of the top is like stretchy t-shirt material and I'm wearing this in a size medium by the way. And then the sleeves are, you know, puffy and they're more of a poplin kind of material, not stretchy. And I've seen a lot of shirts like this or variations of this this year, but I was looking for just the right one because the sleeves have poof and stretch elastic at the bottom, but they're not too crazy poofy. And again, wearing it with the white denim, I'm a sucker for black and white. And again, with the sandals, from Dream Pairs, the heels, and that same little dumpling bag. I love a black and white outfit with neutral accessories. It just looks rich. It's an expensive kind of look. It's classic. And this gives a fresh 2023 twist on it with the puff sleeve blouse. Do you want to save even more money on your online shopping? Then be sure to join Rakuten. It's an online rebate program that can earn you cash back on practically all your online shopping that you're doing anyway. It's free to join. And if you join using my link, which will be down in the description, you'll get a bonus $30 rebate on your first rebate check. They're paid out quarterly and you can either get a physical check or a deposit into your PayPal account. So what are you waiting for? Sign up with Rakuten today and start saving even more money. Keeping with the black and white theme, I found this top recently at White House Black Market. I've been a huge fan of theirs for years. Back when I was working in a corporate environment, the vast majority of my work clothes came from White House Black Market. I popped in the other day just to see what was new and my eye went to this little top because I love an elevated basic. And this top I liked because I really like the stripes. I like the scooped neck. It's not too low, but it does give me a nice open neck. And I liked the little gold button detail here on the shoulder. You could dress this up with some white pants, slacks, white jeans, but I decided to just be casual and put it on with some white shorts. These are those same Banana Republic factory shorts as the khaki ones you saw earlier. I decided to keep my footwear neutral and I have on these neutral slides again from Dream Pairs, but 
These black ones would look equally great with this outfit to kind of have the sandwich effect of the black on top and the black shoe. But being 5'2", I like the elongating effect of a nude shoe, so that's what I went with. This is just a cute way to dress up a basic shorts and tee outfit so you're cool, you're comfortable, but you look nicer than your typical shorts and tee. It looks a little bit elevated, but you're still just as cool and comfortable. So I've been looking for a little denim skirt for the longest time and couldn't find exactly what I wanted. And then lo and behold, I found it at Target. This is just a classic little denim skirt. It's not as tight as a pencil skirt. It's just a normal little denim mini. And it's $25 by Universal Thread and I'm wearing it in a size six. And then this top I'm wearing with it is another one of these cool gauze tops. This one is from Old Navy and I just love it. It's in this kind of a terracotta rosy color that I absolutely love. And since the top is kind of billowy, I thought it looked really nice, you know, with this more fitted skirt because you don't want to wear tight with tight or baggy with baggy. So I thought this was a good combination. Let me know what you think. Even a neutral lover like me needs some color in her life every once in a while. So these last couple of outfits, I'm bringing the color. And this top, you may be surprised to know where I found it. When I was perusing the Democracy website, looking at those cargo skirts, I ran across this. So not only do they have all kinds of bottoms, they have tops too. And I just loved the colors and the style of this top. It's such a happy, bright floral. It's got the little frills here on the shoulders. Very much an on-trend silhouette for blouses. And with all the bright colors going on in this blouse, I thought jeans. <laughs> it's got the blue in it. It goes perfect with jeans. And this outfit, I'm wearing a pair of sandals that you guys saw in my previous Dream Pairs video, and it's these clog sandals. These are so comfortable, easy to walk in, and they give you some nice height, but it doesn't feel like you're wearing a heel because of the little platform. To round out the look, I grabbed my bright sunny yellow Portland leather goods bag. It brings out the yellow in this blouse and is the perfect complement, I think, to this outfit. Now you could wear this blouse with white. I think that would be great or even with shorts or a skirt or whatever. So this is just a happy addition to my spring and summer wardrobe from Democracy. This next outfit is super happy. I mean, you can't be in a bad mood when you're wearing this. And it is from J. Crew Factory, the tank, the skirt, and even these earrings. Aren't they fun? And I saw this on the website and it just jumped at me and I had to get it. I love the outfit, but I'm not sure if I love it on me. I'm wearing a medium in the tank top and a medium in the skirt. Usually J. Crew Factory things run a little bit small and that's why I got a medium in both pieces. The skirt, however, is a little bit roomy. I don't know if I like the way it's laying on me. I don't have the smallest waist in the world and so this kind of smocked waist uh, with a little frill on top, I don't know if it's doing me any favors. If you have a very hourglass figure and you've got a really tiny waist, then this kind of skirt and this whole outfit is perfect for you because it nips you in at your smallest and then glides over your hips and thighs. So I'm not sure if this is a great look for me, although I love the colors. So just give me some feedback and let me know what you think. The skirt does come in some different colors, but you can't beat this orange and pink together. This is such a hot color combo for 2023. And this is just a perfect summer outfit for any kind of get togethers. And I added a pair of Dream Pairs woven heeled slides to this look. These are from my previous Dream Pairs haul. And I think they are just the perfect shoe with this whole outfit. Remember, everything from today's video will be linked down in the description and in a pinned comment. Thanks again to Dream Pairs for sponsoring today's video. And if you liked this one, be sure to watch this video next where you'll see even more outfit ideas. Thanks again for joining me today. And until I see you in my next video, have a stylish day.
拜拜。